Welcome back to another episode of Rivera Family of Five. Today we got another sneaker review. Today we bring you the Jordan 11. It was first released in 2001, then re-released in 2010. And this year, at the end of the year nonetheless, we get to be blessed once again with the Jordan 11 now these are super nice, I dig them. They got a neutral gray Nubuck upper with that patent leather going all the way around so you can shine baby on or off the court. Make sure to check out our sponsor. Their information is gonna be in the description down below. And without further ado, let's get on with the review. All right, now let's go to the unboxing. And as always, we need a knife. So, um, this box, I can already tell you, looks a little damaged. Uh, it, when, in all fairness, it did get shipped during the Thanksgiving holiday, so I'm gonna give them the benefit of the doubt. Remember kids, knives are dangerous. Don't try this at home. So right off the gate, I can tell that the box is not in good condition. Oh my God. Wait, what is this? I don't know. Well, we had some beads come out the box. I don't we know what that was. We had some beads come out, but the box is in... Horrible condition. Hello. But we're not wearing the box. But some of you do care, but the box is... Flappy. Not in the best shape. Well, is it, I'm gonna be real with y'all. I'm keeping 100. The box is nasty. But. Yeah, we don't. I know there's people that don't wear boxes, but he likes to have his boxes in perfect. I like my boxes being pristine condition because I like for them to look pretty in my closet. So the box is kind of beat up. It's a lot beat up. It's a lot beat up. Right here, too. Look, it's real. Um, dented. It's really bad. Makes me sad. But what matters is what's on the inside. So hopefully, um, the shoes came in the good The shoes look better than the box. And without further ado, comments down, baby doll. Three, two, one. So, the shoes don't look bad. Good job, good job. So, the shoes look in, like they're in pristine condition. They look like, it looks like the box took the majority of the damage or all of the damage. So, here baby doll, you handle this one while I handle this one. It did come with some broken silica boxes on the inside. That's where the uh, beads were. But we do got some stock edge stickers. StockX, where you at? Bing bong! What? So you got the StockX certified uh, tag as well, for those of you who wanna rock them. So you got that neutral Neva upper, which feels soft to the touch. You got that dazzling, dazzling gray patent leather, and you got that icy bottom, the icy blue bottom to finish it off. And you got some white accents right here in the midsole, with the white laces. You got that white 23 in the back with the white jump man on the side. Overall, the sneaker looks pretty dope. I like it. It feels good. The quality on the um, new book on the upper feels really soft to the touch. You got the gray, the neutral gray on the tongue which feels so, so good. You got a little bit of a stain here on the tongue, which ain't too bad. You got the quality sole protectors. These seem to be plastic. Wow, I never seen this. And I like it because it matches the color of the shoe. So you got the quality, quality. You know, these aren't cardboard, baby. These are high quality. You got the Jumpman logo right here in the middle. So these are good. Um, I've never seen this before, but uh, let me know if you have a comment. But let me see this left one. Also got the, um, oh, got the plastic quality sole protector on the inside. 
I would hate for someone to start wearing these with their sneakers. But I've seen people wear cardboard ones on the inside to Wait, keep from does, creasing. But how does their feet fit? They cut it right here at the bottom. If y'all wear these I've never seen that. inside your shoes to keep them from creasing, please go seek medical attention ASAP. <laughs> like now. <laughs> Preferably of a psychiatric type. <laughs> so you got the jump man right here in the middle. So. Can you imagine someone wearing these, the plastic ones? Like, There's gonna be some bloody grays. And you can't even cut this. You can. Where there's Look, a will, there's a way. So thick. You can get a little hacksaw and cut it up. But anyway, <laughs> let's go ahead and get some. Let's get up. So let's go ahead and get up close and personal with them. And then, uh, you know, put them on that spinning wheel of justice, baby. You know what time it is. So let's go. When you take a look at this bad boy, it looks like it's been picked from China all the way here. Good God almighty. So go ahead, baby. We like to unbox it like it's the first time. So go ahead and do us the honors. So thank God. So this is a little sticker or a little tag that came with the uh, sneakers. So thank God the sneakers made it okay. It's a little dusty, you know, from the, all the kicking, all that FedEx during the holiday season. But we got the sneakers in great condition, baby. That's what matters. Look what, what you take a look at them. Just look at them. Almost as pretty as my wife. These are high quality sneakers. The tongue feels soft to the touch. Super soft. Um, the new book all around the sneaker feels super, super soft. That high quality patent leather with the icy bottom. You got that carbon fiber so you can go faster on the bottom. You got the jump, man. You got the white accents all around the sneaker. Overall, the sneakers are high quality. Check them out. Let me know what you think in the comments. Quality check. Nike, y'all better step y'all game up because y'all losing to this one. Got that carbon fiber so you can go faster, so you can hit light speed on the court. On or off the court. Got the white laces. The white midsole. Let me look at the other one. You got that patent leather all the way around. Look at that shine. Look at the way it gleams. You got that plastic sole protector on the inside. High quality, even that's high quality. Shout out to our sponsor. You can find their information down in the description below. High, high, high quality. So let's get you some of that B-roll. Now it is time for the spinner.
Now let's go to the on foot review. Now time to take these bad boys off. So Jordan 11s are some of people's favorite Jordans yeah. and there's a good reason why. You got the Nubuck upper on these with the patent leather round baby and you got the icy blue bottom. You just can't beat it or can you? Let us know what you think in the comments. And uh, thank you for joining us. Make sure that you like this video, that you subscribe. Share with a friend. Let the world know where you can find the best sneaker reviewers. It just happens to be a husband and wife team. Dream team, baby. Teamwork makes the dream work. So make sure that you subscribe. Hit that little bell icon so you get all the notifications from all of our videos. And let them know where else they can find us, baby doll. And you can also find us on our Instagram, at Rivera Family of Vine. So, friends and family, we love you all. God bless. Thank you so much for the support. And until next time, peace.